Hi all, very good morning today. Today our topic is how to generate JMeter temporary root CA certificate. Okay, this is our topic. Majorly in JMeter tool, right? Whenever you need to generate the uh, the temporary root, set, uh, root CA certificate, it's valid only seven days only. That reason you need to keep on regenerate. Otherwise, you are not able to record any script. Okay. That is in what you need to do, right? You need to regenerate that one. That is in how you need to regenerate temporary root CA certificate whenever it's invalid or expired. Okay. First one. Step one. Go to JMeter bin folder. Okay. And delete the first one JMeter temporary root CA certificate. Second one. Uh, process server dot JKS files. Both file. Both files you need to delete. That is the first step. Both you need to delete. Okay. Step one, that one. Step two. Open any JMeter script. Example, our common application, right? WebTools.jmx. Click on to the HTTP test script recorder element. Okay. Whenever you need to try to record the script, right? You need to use this element. It's common. HTTP test script recorder. Okay. Click on start button. Okay, whenever you click on start button, okay, once you click on start, automatically JMeter temporary temporary root CA certificate. Okay, and the process server JKS file both it's regenerated and it's valid within seven days. Okay, this is the way you need to regenerate. Another one, step three is maybe uh, some old versions JMeter, right? Maybe some anything issue will be came. That reason. Step 3 is restart the JMeter and use it. Now it's working as expected. Okay. This is the steps that very just uh, three steps only. You need to working as expected. How you need to generate the temporary root CA certificate. Another one, it's a one general comment. Okay. Any issue, please comment me based on comment section. As soon as possible, I will give in my reply. Otherwise, I will create another video and post it. Okay. Okay. Please comment me whenever you try to regenerate right? maybe it's not able to generate it based on versions otherwise any some other issue also uh, you can your issue clearly you can mention to the comment section right based on that one i will provide my solution okay okay now you need to go to the j meter and you need to see how you need to resolve that one okay i'm already coming to bin folder okay how you need to go right you can see my JMeter is available in e folder. Go to Apache JMeter 5.4.1. Go to bin folder. Once you can go to bin folder, right? You can see Apache JMeter. Okay. Apache JMeter temporary root CA. Okay. It's a security certificate. Just you need to click on and you need to delete that one. Okay. Now it's deleted. Another one go to process server dot jks. You can see this is the file process server dot jks process server dot jks file. Both you need to delete it. Now it is deleted, right? Okay. Now you do not have any files. Now you need to open to the any JMeter, and I am already open to the web tool application sample script. Okay, just just a second just you can click on to the HTTPS test script recorder okay you can see guys in bin folder now Apache JMeter temporary root CA certificate it's not available this is different guys this is load runner one okay JMeter temporary root CA certificate it's not available now and you can see JMeter this is the last one right you can see process server dot JKS files also it's not available that file also this is different RMI key store different process server okay there is no any process server dot JKS files now once you need to go to JMeter HTTPS test script recorder right just you can click on start target controller is going to use but no such controller exit ensure your regarding controller thread group no 
not incorrectly. Okay. Just a minute. I will create one new, add it to the thread group, mm -hmm. config element, um, go to logic controller and add it to the recording controller, non-test element, edge test script recorder, right, you can, now you can go to recording controller is target. Now you need to start. Just two minutes, guys. You need to start that one. Yeah, now you need to see root CA certificate Apache JMeter temporary root CA created in JMeter bin directory. Now it's coming right. You can go to JMeter, same bin folder. T JMeter, T JMeter, T JMeter, T JMeter, T JMeter, temporary root CA security and created today one. You can see today date is 22 March 2023. 22 March 2023. Okay, first root CA certificate is generated after uh, another one. You can see. Process server, process server dot JKS, JKS file also is generated. Okay, both the files you need to generate and write. Now you need to record any script it's recorded. Okay, before recording, okay, you can you can open to the your browser. Just a minute. I will open my Internet Explorer. Okay, now you need to go to the, go to settings. No, still it's not open. Just one minute guys, you need to work at that one page. Little bit slow this one. Just a minute. It just need to open to the Google. That is
Okay guys, I will. Okay guys, I will. Okay guys. All right. These are called certificates. 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 Okay, after you need to start the recording, right? You are able to record that's all. That's all, guys. Okay, actually, it's not opening this one. Just a minute, you need to delete this. Go to the end, go to the end. The settings totally different guys, totally different guys, totally different guys. Yeah you can yeah you can yeah you can yeah you can now you can see you can go to the Internet Explorer go to internet options okay in internet option right you can go to the content and go to select the certificates in certificates right it's not a personal one uh, trusted root ca certificates you can see this is uh, this is uh, j meter root ca certificate and expiration february 1st 2020 it's already expired okay just you need to remove that one click on yes and yes click on yes it's done now you need to import it to the latest one right just click on to the import button next and click on to the browse uh, now apache jmt bin folder right you can see apache jmt temporary root ca certificate just you click on that and open the file now file will be came right just click on next trusted root ca certificate authorities only you need to place that column only Let's click on finish. Yes, you can give us right. Import was yeah, the import was successful. Now you need to see this is the latest one and valid 29 March 2023. Okay. Now you need to close and you need to start the recording based on your process. Okay. Okay, this is the way only guys. You need to generate the both the processor dot JKS file, another one, Apache Jmeter temporary root CA certificate. It's very simple only. Okay, you can try it. Okay, whenever you face any issue, right? Just please comment me. I will provide as soon as possible my uh, my uh, output okay otherwise most of the time the process is same maybe browsers will differentiated and what are the voice you are using and uh, another versions jmeter versions also maybe your system any specific uh, blocking um, any antivirus that type of one right maybe that one only will block you need to check yourself also still you are facing any issue Yes, comment me. I will 100% I will provide the solution that one. Okay. Otherwise, I will create the separate video also. 
based on your comment okay yeah that's all guys today and uh, i will connect the my next video thanks everyone bye